Hey guys, a couple days ago we were visiting friends in Scotts Valley, California here, and uh, we had a good sunny day, so Anne and I decided to take a trip up on the Pacific Coast Highway, up as far as Half Moon Bay. Um, previously we've explored down around Carmel and Monterey and Big Sur, but I've never been up from Santa Cruz up to uh, up to Half Moon Bay, and I really wanted to see the Mavericks Beach. That's where the, the big surf competition is held once in a while when they get those big, humongous, world-class waves up there. Um, also, uh, looking up, I found this natural bridge is State Beach, and in there they have um, uh, monarch butterflies that uh, come there in the winter, and they cluster in the eucalyptus trees, so we wanted to go check that out as well. So I took the camera along and I got some footage um, here from the Natural Bridges State Beach down there and also up in Half Moon Bay. There wasn't too much to be seen at uh, Mavericks. The waves weren't huge, but it was kind of neat to walk out to the famous beach and kind of get a look at it. And also we found some really cool birds that were, were perched in the trees along there. Um, on the way back, we stopped in at a place called uh, Sam's Oyster Bar and had a nice lunch. And then also I have some footage, dash cam footage along the trip there. And we stopped at a few other places along the way. Uh, this Pescadero um, State Park or beach and Pigeon Point Lighthouse and a really nice beach at uh, Greyhound Rock County Park. There's just so many places to stop and look at and things to do along here. You could take a whole week and explore just this stretch. But uh, I got uh, some footage of what we did that day, so I hope you enjoy it. Hey guys, Ray from Love Your RV. Well, today we're going to go up the California coast. We're visiting friends here at kind of a, a retirement community of park model homes, but they also have some uh, hookup sites for visitors. So it's really nice uh, of them to do that. So we have a nice little place to put the rig. Um, we're going to drive up uh, from Santa Cruz. I want to go up and see uh, the Mavericks Beach up at Half Moon Bay where they do the surfing. And Anne wants to check out a place that has a bunch of monarch butterflies called Natural Bridges State Park. So I thought I'd bring the camera along and show you the, the coastline and the views we see. So let's go. Okay, here we go. First stop, Natural Bridges State Beach and uh, Monarch Butterfly Natural Preserve. There's a boardwalk here that winds into a tree-filled canyon with thousands of monarch butterflies, supposedly, clustering on the leaves here. Especially, they said, in the cooler days, so we're good today. It's only going to be into the 60s. Clustered on that. Wow. You see them? Around maybe yeah. 10 miles or something. I'm not sure, but you see them all around here in the day. But they store up fat for the winter, so they don't, they don't need you every day. Every day. Super green pond. Thank you. 
Check out this cool tree. So they have a nice uh, nature loop hike. Takes you through the coastal forest here. Try to find the butterflies. Right now they all seem to be down in the canyon clustered together, but we see the odd ones flying around here. The odd small cluster. Yeah, so here's where we parked. Cost you ten dollars to get into the parking lot inside, although there was parking outside the park it looked like and you can walk in. And there's a little visitor center here. And here's the monarch trail down here. That's where we just walked around. Then there's kind of a wetland trail, but we're gonna head out to the beach and see the what it's named for, the natural bridge. Look at all the pelicans. Go check out the pelicans. Wow, gorgeous. What a beautiful little beach.
So here we are, Half Moon Bay, and we've parked and we're walking out to Pillar Point State Conservation Area, and out there is the famous uh, Mavericks, where they had the big, big surf competition, and it gets the some of the biggest waves in the world. So we'll go see if we see some surfers out there or any big waves. Looks like a nice hike along the the ocean here. Notice this is a good place to walk your dog, dog friendly. There are some big waves up there. Let's so walk to this other point here. It's a, definitely a type of heron. It's got a yellowy face. Yeah, that's not the same bird I was photographing before. Kind of a yellowy face. Yeah. The other one I was photographing was very mottled. Oh. But it's also not a creepy heron of some other kind. You th do you think those are the babies of the herons? The ones with the yellow? Yeah. No, the ones that have like a light cream color. He's just making sure you're not going to do anything. <laughs> I think that's also not the same bird I photographed. 